Hey, what's up guys? It's Pat and welcome back to Evil Minecraft. And I know I ended last time jumping into the portal for the cliffhanger and I honestly totally forgot something so I had to come back out. I thought that was pretty funny, but um, yeah, I wanted to make a bow before we went in because we might actually have to fight, you know, like ghasts and um, lots of stuff like blazes. So let's make one. We actually had enough string from when we killed those couple spiders. So we should definitely do this right now before we go in because we do have nine arrows It's not a lot, but it could be really helpful So we've got a bow with nine arrows and also I do want to enchant some stuff I decided that I'm gonna use my nine levels I'm just gonna do like level one enchants on like everything and honestly Hope that it's good because I'm gonna replace this stuff eventually anyway, so it doesn't really matter <laughs> So I take off everything and hopefully get like protection one um, You know something on something, you know what I'm saying? All right, so level one enchant protection one. I'm happy with that. I just want level one. I don't want to waste any levels here. Projectile protection and protection one in the boots. And we've got protection one. That's not bad at all, really. I mean, it's going to help me a little bit, obviously. And I'm glowing now. I look cooler. Take a quick, quick look. I look much better. All right, so I'm also going to do... What do I have left? I've got five levels. All right, so... But I don't know if you can get infinity with a level one enchant. I don't think you can, but I'll take power one. Power one, I'll take that. Not bad. And diamond sword. You ready? Sharpness one. So all this stuff obviously is going to um get improved. Did I hear something scary? I thought I heard something. I don't know. I'm already freaking out. You know, I always am freaking out when I do this series. But I think we're actually ready to go in. But I'm gonna go to sleep first. Might as well. It, it's not night. It's dark. Never mind. Let's just go. <laughs> it's not that late yet. But I think we're better off just enchanting this stuff. It's not many levels, and all this stuff's going to get replaced anyway, so it shouldn't really matter too much. Why am I bringing a diamond with me? I, I have no idea. All right, guys. I put the diamond back and went to sleep, so now it is time to jump in once again. My cliffhanger really didn't work out since clearly I forgot to do some stuff <laughs> before we went into it. All right, so we are now in the nether. Is there, like, a way out over here? Oh, yeah, there is. It's loading in. And honestly, this might be safer than the normal world. Just thinking about it. Because the pigmen, you know, they're not actually aggressive unless I accidentally hit one. The gas are the only thing we have to worry about. Of course, when we do find ourselves a nice nether fortress, I'm probably going to be a little nervous. And I might as well grab this stuff. Why not? So we are in the nether. And I need to find a way. I'm in such a bad spot. Why is my portal got to be up here like this? That's just mean. Like, normally I'd be able to, you know, at least walk somewhere from my portal. From here, I can't walk anywhere. I'm trying to find a possible, like, way to get down from here. This is awful. We're going to have to go the other direction and, I don't know, turn or something. <laughs> Put out this fire. <laughs> Keep it away from me. Okay, so I do have the choice of going nowhere. There's, like, nowhere I can go. Give me this. Give me that mushroom. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I am going to go down, I guess. I don't know. We'll grab some of this nether rack. I'm sure I'll use it. I'm going to use everything we get anyway. So, let's go. This has got to lead us down to more fire, of course. All right, we're getting down there. We're getting down there. Of course, it has to be stressful like this. Um, we got to come up with a way, though, to be able to see this portal. I think it actually might be in a good spot because it's, like, way up there. I'll be like, oh, yeah, that's my portal. I, I can see it from everywhere. So, that, that might be good. So I actually need to get down from here, not hurt myself. I haven't seen any gas, which is good. Normally, I like to try to deflect their, like, fireballs back at them. I'm probably not going to do it in this series. I'm probably going to try to avoid them as much as possible, to be honest. Because we really do need to find another fortress so we can, you know, get some blazes and some blaze rods and stuff like that. And get going with that. All right, how the hell do I get down from here? This is ridiculous. This is way too much work. Normally I spawn in a fine location. This location is terrible Okay, so to make this obvious usually I like to do something like this is put up like cobblestone Where I was because like that definitely shows up pretty good in an area like this So that should be a pretty good idea that I have to go back this way So I think we've made it down. Oh, I totally forgot for a minute that infernal mobs is here So these are actually gonna be really hard because there's so many pigmen and they all of a sudden become aggressive if they're infernal. <laughs> they're very mad. They're not very nice anymore. <laughs> okay, so we're going to go down and have a look around. I'm actually ner I'm really nervous now because I totally forgot about that. 
We are gonna take so much. We're gonna die here. Like, look, there's one over there. I'm not going that way. You guys, nice. Nope, you're not. Okay, I guess I'm gonna try to avoid the pigmen. <laughs> They're too dangerous. So we will head down this way. I'm gonna check them all out. All I have to do is put my cursor over them to see if they're rare spawn or not. And we will head through here. Really need to find ourselves a fortress. Lately, I've had really good luck. They've been like right next to me as I spawn in. I have a feeling we're gonna have a tough time. Tough series, gonna be like impossible for me to find anything. Oh, there's one right there. They've upped the spawn rate of those, right? In one of the recent patches, cause they're like all over the place now. Okay, so slowly, but surely, we we'll go towards this. And see if we can find a way in. Because we have to be very careful, obviously. Especially if blazes. That's going to be terrible. We have nine arrows. It's not a lot. Not a lot at all. Your skeletons. Okay, how am I going to get in here? Let's just break it open. These are cool blocks anyway. Is there going to be like... um? I'm pretty sure there's not going to be any way in from here, but... You never know. There could be like a bottom floor. I always like to, you know, to hope... Alright, at least I'm going to grab these blocks. We're going to go around and see if there's a better, like, way to get into this place. It's got to be. And you can see my nether portal right there. Let me actually put up some more blocks. You can definitely see it from there. If I get to that block, I'll know. And yeah, there's a lot of pigmen right here. A lot of them. And I'm not going to grab all this ore. I mean, it's all over the place. Alright, slow. I'm, I'm friendly. Don't hurt me. Nice sword you got there. Glowing, I see it. Alright. So I imagine up there is probably the way to get into there. We'll see if there's possibly another way in around here somewhere. I hate stepping on this slow sand. I can't stand it. Alright, so I have 38 blocks. It's probably enough to climb myself up there, huh? Alright, we're gonna do it. Don't knock me off. No matter what happens, nothing. Please knock me off this. Praying for it. I should be almost there. Alright, and I can get across now. Okay. So we're getting towards it. We friends? Yes, we are. Alright, so I'm looking all over the place here, guys. You can still see my portal in the distance. Like, probably really hard to see in the video. But it's right there. <laughs> Which is kind of perfect. Okay, so we're going to climb up here. And we are going to hope for the best. Alright, these guys, they seem to be nice. We're having pretty good luck. And I think I see my way in. I think it's right here. I'm not good at fighting blazes, by the way. I've never been good at it. I'm actually going to put these, like, next to each other, my weapons. I've always been terrible at fighting blazes. I know a lot of people are much better at fighting than me. I usually die, so... <laughs> we'll see how it goes. I'm a little nervous. I actually feel like I might sneeze. I, I don't know if that's a, a bad sign or a good sign. Or what, really? Okay. So, yeah, I've definitely found my way to it. Is there a down? Oh, first ghast. Right, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Is there a downstairs here? So, yeah, we definitely need to avoid any ghast fireballs coming at our face. There's no easy way down here, huh? Okay. What I can do is probably go through the walls and make stairs down from here. Because I'm too afraid to try to walk over to the other spots. But I definitely should be able to go down over here. I would think, at least. To bring me all the way down. Um, I should be safe here. Let me see. Let me get out my torches. I'll move it with my flint and steel. And let me just light it up in here a little bit. Paranoia is my biggest problem. So I've, I've blocked myself in. <laughs> I feel like it's something we've done a lot so far in this series. Okay, so there's got to be a way through here. Okay, so yeah, there is. Is there anything in here? No. All right, that's good. That's good. There's nothing. We don't want anything in here. Not right now. I also do plan on fighting the Wither in this series, so if we actually killed some Wither skeletons, that would be great. Of course, they have that damn Wither effect. I am going to take so much damage. I have one golden apple. If we die here, guys, um, what I'm going to do, because I'm already prepared for this for death, I'm just going to run back, like, off-camera, stuff like that. So, you know, it won't waste any time for the video if I do die. So, yeah. Trying to be prepared, though. I'm going to be as cautious as possible. Honestly, I'm afraid to go this way. Alright, so... Oh, I see the spawner right there. Okay, this could be our chance, though, to actually get ourselves 
Some blaze rods. We're gonna need them for the stuff, and I, I'm scared. <laughs> okay. I have power one. All right, Pigman, don't mess with me. All right, two blazes right there. All I need to do is take down a couple, and I'll be really happy. So what we're gonna have to do is use this to our biggest advantage possible. I'm also concerned about, like, the sides. You friendly? It's a friendly Pigman. Okay, so I'm probably at a good, like, range right now to shoot. I really don't want to miss, though. I have nine arrows. All right. That seems like that would be a good shot. All right, it was. Please kill them. Don't hit me. Did it die? I think we killed one. I know it's a spawner there. I'm not going to destroy the spawner because we, you know, we're going to need to kill these. All right, run. Grab blaze rods before death. Now run like hell. <laughs> That's not good, whatever's coming for me right now. All right, I avoided them. All right, I actually got a, I got a blaze rod without dying or getting hit at all. That's cool. All right, I got one. How many can we get? I don't know. I've got five arrows left. So that means I should be able to, like, realistically kill two more. Look around here. I feel like something always ambushes me from, like, the corner. I see a gas right there, and I've avoided it. Yeah, that's the kind of stuff I don't want to take damage from, obviously. Put out these fires. Very messy gas. Alright, where is he? Where'd you go, bro? Gas? Alright, maybe he's not around. He must have went that way. Okay, so I can try to get another one. Because I see one right there. He's kind of in front of the block, though. He's like, just lit up there, scared me. All right, these guys, you seem to be friendly. Those are the kind of things that could be like an instant death. I actually got a blazer. I heard something shoot. It scared me. I thought I did at least. All right, I think I see. Okay, so there's quite a few blaze spawners around here. And I'm oh, that shot right over my head. That shot right over my head. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Let's do this. I am gonna go for it again. Which one's shooting at me though? Is it the one that's right over there? Because I didn't really notice. It's probably him. All right, please don't waste this. This has got to be a perfect shot or I'm gonna be wasting an arrow. Got him. All right, one more. He's dead. Okay, run. <laughs> please have dropped a blaze rod. I see it. All right, we've got two. Two blaze rods. This is actually working out so good. So much better than I expected. Okay, so this is what I should have done my whole Minecraft life. I could have been much safer. I've got three more arrows. That means I should be able to get one more blaze rod. Okay, so I see one right there. And there's a pigman right next to him. Last thing I want to do is hit a pigman because, you know, then his whole family will be coming after me. They're very, they're not nice people, guys. They're not nice people. It'd be nice to get some glowstone while we're here, though, definitely. I want to get some. All right, you're friendly. You're friendly. Where is he? Where are they? <laughs> this is bad. I feel like I'm in a bad spot. I'm like closer than I want to be right now. I just want to get one more. Okay, I saw that. So that guest is... He means business. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? <laughs> Normally I'd knock those back. But in case I mess it up, that would be probably pretty bad, you know? Alright, let me put these out. Just want to get one more blaze rod. Uh-oh. There it goes. He needs to get out of the way, though. Fly away. All right, he seems to be heading that way, which is good. Bye. All right, he's gone. Okay. So I'm back to it. No, I'm not. Okay, I was wrong. I was wrong. <laughs> I was very, very wrong. Oh, my God. Did you see that? He's actually way down here. That's the worst spot ever. Yeah, that that's not going to be good. I'm going to wait for him to, to leave, I guess. I, I don't really know what my other choice is. So, yeah, I hope he goes away now. Leave me alone. He's, like, right there. You know what we can do? We can go downstairs, and, you know, he might despawn <laughs> or something. All right, we got to be very careful here, too. I see the magma. Give me some magma cream, please. All right, no one around at all. 
The Wither Skeletons are probably going to be pretty tough. Is that another magma thing? Alright, no one around here. Just a nice little... Where is he? There he is. Don't jump on me. Oh my god. Alright, so we'll go back up. We'll see if he's gone now. But he definitely could be. I'm hoping so. And then I want to get that last one. Because we only have so many arrows at the moment. Alright, I see him over there. Please leave. Please leave. He's flying around the area. It's driving me crazy. And I don't want to waste arrows trying to hit him either. Because, you know, I might miss. And then I only have so many arrows. Yeah, there's too many, guys. That, there's too many. We're going to have to give up on that. We will have to give up on that. So let's explore around here a little bit. And hopefully, you know, we'll come up with another chance to get some... Oh! So we can definitely get these for a nice farm. Alright, is there anything around here? No, we're safe. So I'm going to grab all this. And um, what do I have? Do I have a shovel? Yeah, I do. Awesome. So I'll grab this nether wart. And then we can actually, you know, grow our own nether wart. We're going to need that for potions too. Alright, I don't see anything around us. Might as well grab all the soul sand as well. So we are racking it up right now. Getting all kinds of stuff. Alright, so let me get the other side. It's going to go good with our garden. Alright, perfect. Things have went unbelievably well today. Like, I actually got blaze rods. I didn't take any damage. And I got the stuff for a garden. That is awesome. But I'm going to end it here, guys. Next time, we will continue exploring this place. And hopefully get everything we need. So we can head out of this evil area. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.